several Good Samaritans working to clean up the Boca Inlet left trashed by a group of boaters. And tonight we're hearing from a teen who says that he was on that boat as full garbage bins of trash were dumped into the ocean. Local 10 Samir Nefsi is live in Boca Raton with the exclusive. And Samir, you spoke with one of those people working to get the ocean cleaned up. Samir. Yeah, Calvin, so we actually just stumbled across this young woman who says she saw that viral video and decided she herself needed to go in and clean the inlet just behind me. Of course, that viral video captured on Sunday from an event called Boca Bash. In that video, you see a group of young boaters taking cans of garbage and just dumping it into the water. It's a now infamous viral video. Young boaters along Boca Inlet trashing the marine environment illegally dumping two trash cans full of trash into the water Sunday swells online many outraged by the video we live in such a beautiful area no one should be doing that it's just not good says Lola the tremble who felt compelled to clean up some of the trash creating this Instagram video they had two full trash cans of trash like what are they doing going out there you know now she says this was just some of the trash collected near the dumping ground. Just not a good look. It's not cute. It's not cool. Don't throw your trash out. Meanwhile, this miner who we are not identifying says he was on the boat Sunday with friends, adding he did not participate in the dumping. I completely disagree. I do not think that, that should have been the like ch choice he made. This as Florida Fish and Wildlife Commission continues their investigation. We are identifying the subjects that were involved. We're working closely with our state attorney's office here in Palm Beach County and we'll determine the appropriate charges for these individuals. Leaving many like the tremble wondering why anyone would so boldly trash our treasure. I would say do better, make better decisions. All right, and a spokesperson for FWC says no arrests have been made. Now, the name of those boaters or the names of those boaters have not yet been released. We're live tonight in Boca Raton. I'm Samir Nafsi, Local 10 News.